right, and it should just automatically capture. There we go, and we're back. What a stupid fucking experience that was. Here's hoping this game is at all better. Now we're getting into more sort of more fair that I know the Tom Clancy like this, this is more sort of standard Tom Clancy stuff in my mind that it's anyone outside of the US is a potential threat we are somewhere it's mysterious conspiracy stuff going on that makes no fucking sense So, this is the only Tom Clancy game, that's, well, Splinter Cell game, that I owned, uh, like, back in the day. And I remember getting as far as Jerusalem, which I don't remember how far that is in the game. Good job leaving DNA evidence there, mate. Alright. That's a good sign. Let's get straight into it then. Oh. Okay, we're fine. Don't even worry about it. Never punished. Stream. Um, I have. Oh, I updated. Right, there's your problem. I updated the uh, title, not the uh, the game. Yeah, bonk. All right, let's do this. It wasn't your day. Well, I wasn't very good in simulation. The NSA just called me. We have a problem in East Timor. What kind of problem? A big one. Sam Fisher looking like a piece of beef as always. Those Blaskowitz here? Good question. I'm liking the minority report screen though. That's exactly what you have to find out, sir. The zoom in pull out shot. Straw dogs. Infiltrate the embassy. Tara Dandoa. Indonesian guerrilla group led by Suhadi Sad Sadono has invaded the US Embassy to Dili to tell it for uh, uh. Right, well visually this is definitely an upgrade. I can Bishop, Yeah, this looks way nicer already. Dolly Zoom, yep. Let's work on stealth. Your gun should always be your last resort. Invisibility is your best weapon. We've got a network of photocells on your suit connected to a visibility meter on your opset. If the meter's at three, you're lit up yeah. like Times Square. Oh, it's Times Square now, not a Dutch brothel. Before you infiltrate the embassy, let me reintroduce DP Brunton, our interagency consultant. He's got an update for the mission. 
I'll keep it brief. I'm sure you know I'm excited to be part of the team. The Joint oh. Chiefs want this mission kept non I was trying to bring you next. Zero. We can't endanger the hostages. Understood. And with some due respect, leave any <laughs> so, to the all. say to the Lambert. I don't want the voices in my head to become a crowd. There we go. Get inside the embassy. The situation is delicate and largely unknown. So walk softly. Okay. And carry a big gun. You make the game look lighter? Yes! Uh, for real though, let me check the uh, options, see if there's like a gamma slider or something. No! No there isn't! Position, yeah that's like screen spacing. Uh, nope, there are no visual sliders. It's the PS2, such things, such things were. Actually, can I, if I go into, can I do it through OBS? Emulator capture, properties. Advanced properties. Uh, no, it's not looking like I can Color? No. Uh, filters. Can I apply like a gamma filter? Key color correction. No. I cannot change. Okay, I can't change any of the. Uh, I can't change any of the coloration, I'm afraid. I'll just have to keep me uh, Miss Sunny's on. Oh, and then I can. Okay. Whoop and whoop. The game seems to be leaning a bit more on the darkness. <laughs> Sam Fisher is uh, making the anime grunts. Going. <sighs> Okay, these scene transitions are definitely a lot more natural. Because there's no cutaway to a loading screen. I will definitely say this game is feeling a lot better than the uh, than the first. Oh, by God, does Sam not stop grunting? With a ah, oh, there we go. I can scoot. One always hopes the sequel improves things. You hope. It's not always the case. Sometimes they make things worse. What? Oh, hi. What are you doing? The mission is over. <laughs> My fault. Wasn't paying attention. We detected prematurely. Prematurely detected. Okay, I will actually uh, accept responsibility for that one because I was not watching where I was going. Let's distract to the streamer. Cross it off on your bingo card. Oh. Mine. Boy, it's awfully handy that this uh, 
nation that mostly uses like AK pattern rifles has uh, ammunition for a 5.7 German pistol. There we go. Oh, I see. That's what I meant to do here is I can peek and go, hmm. Wish you. I need to shoot the light. Pass unnoticed. From back to the wall, go to the peeking position, press R2. And... I hear somebody. Why did that take four shots? Dismount and then I jump. For Christ's sake, Fisher, the mission is over. What? You did. You did. I punched him. It said knock a guy out, so I knocked him out. Uh oh, I have a bad feeling. It's taken me three attempts to get past this one guy who's sitting in a plastic lawn chair. And the amount of shots alerted him to being under fire. Yeah, so why didn't the game over trigger until I punched him out? Why did it take so long for it to, to go off? In the feeling that you're going to be... <laughs> you playing General Zero is going to be earlier than expected. Hmm, you might be right. There we go. You have no choice. Knock out the guard and don't forget to hide his body to avoid a full alert. Right. So I, th I think I knocked him out too soon and the the uh, tutorial didn't fire. Give him away back here. Tell you what though, with landmines uh... might spoil my pleasant disposition. <laughs> Heaven forbid. Fisher, activate your thermal to spot the mines. Okay, so it's seeing vision and seeing vision. Ooh. see that's the alternate way of getting over those right I ah here we go I can jump up to here oh or not there we go Shifty. Drop onto one of them. Don't, yeah, don't drop onto the mines, especially not after managing all that. Repel eight feet down. <laughs> I get they need to teach you how to do that, but it's one story. Like, you can drop down most of that just by grabbing the ledge. This is definitely feeling a lot better than uh, the first game did. Tell you what though, this uh, ambient techno is uh, kind of a bop. I'm a sucker for atmospheric synth, so... Jump. Here we go. 
Oh, this is where I'm supposed to learn how to split kick. Ooh, From a half split jump, you can. Oh, I see. Okay, so what I do is I'm going to Prince of Persia my way up. So I hop, hop, hold, change, and then. There we go. That's clever. I wonder how much that's actually going to come up, though. Whistle using L2. If guard hears this, he will investigate. Ah. You right, mate? Off a little bit. You have no choice. Knock out the guard and don't forget to hide his body to avoid a full alert. Grab him and we stick him in the bin. Let's just go out of the way. Wims found you a back door. Avoid the main gate at all cost. Blueprints show an ornamental stream running beneath the entrance. Looks like a viable way in. A little wet's better than a little dead. That stream's your way in. Even if it means moving slowly to minimize your noise level. Fisher, be careful. This village is a walk in the park compared to what needs to be done inside the embassy. Oh, I see. We've only just... Okay. Avoid the front gate. Just move nice and slow through the river. Got it. Why does that you hit man him? Yeah, that's... Strange. Controlling the, the bridge. Shit, bad. The situation is getting worse in the embassy. They seem to be killing hostages now. They seem or they do. Okay, we need to get a move on then. What was that just suggesting? It said press square. Oh, I see. It's, that opens. Right. Yeah, square opens my inventory. There we go. I've got a man in my way, Lambert. How flexible is my zero fatality mandate? As a rock. In fact, we want you to make a new friend. From your onboards, that man looks like one of Sedano's lieutenants. Interrogate him. Find out what he knows about Sodano's defense parameters. Love the chatter we're sifting facts. sounds bad, but lacks specifics. Details on your ops at. Quiet. And jump scare! Oh, oh, I'm your friend now. Except one man out of a mission, he came back with another JRPG party. I need information. I... I don't speak English. I spoke that just fine. I'd be willing to bet your neck that you do. <laughs> I know a little English. <laughs> Good to hear. I'm going inside to meet your friends. Anything I need to worry about? They have guns. <laughs> Thanks, mate. I'm shocked and amazed. What else? Bitch is so sassy. My men planted the mines on our way out. We had to escort... Uh, to defend the village. Escort who? Escort who? Nothing. Escort who? Ah! Nobody. I, I made a mistake. Escort... Who? Ah! 
I don't know his name. Somebody important to Sedano. He's got an American accent and one of his legs is fake. A bald man with dead eyes. A fake leg. Yes. Mm. Go ahead and kill me. That's all I know. I'll do you one better. Nighty night. Let's give you a good swack to the carotid Balan, artery. You got some light? Balan, you hear me? You know, you nice and in the back here. Okay. Our sources are a bit more gradiated now. this boy somewhere else so I mentioned before I mentioned before it's interesting that the interrogation is uh, it's something that comes up a lot in this franchise it comes up later in in other games and in the other games you don't just like sit there while they talk you have to like properly grill them which includes dragging them over to various like objects in the environment that you can beat their head against for information. Whoop. And we're over the wall. Cover or destroy intelligence. Private military corporation CEO Douglas Shetland is trapped inside the embassy, a position of intelligence that cannot be allowed into enemy hands. Why does he have it in the first place? Why does this man have potentially incendiary information on his person? The flash notes confirm there was a hostage situation. Indonesian militants. Yeah, but the hostages are somebody else's game. You're here for information. You have special information held by Douglas. Shetland's your objective. We need to know how much data was lost. Okay. Oh. Right. Don't you mind me. Being told about the success of Tory propaganda. Who died? Freeze, Fisher. Oh. Not a muscle. Sedono is right on top of you. If he sees you, this mission is over. But why me? I, I, I didn't see anything. But did you hear something? No. Just Pandora tomorrow. And then a lot of gibberish. Huh. I couldn't understand any of it. Give me a buzz. Photo ID template. I... Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Well, crap. Hopefully that's not the guy we're here to say. Separated from the others. Absolutely. Kim doesn't open the door unless I radio him. We should break his fingers if we want him to talk. Yes, maybe. But do it quietly. And slowly. Yeah. Back up against the wall. What the hell? Okay, I, I don't think that was the guy that we're here to try and rescue. What? 
don't know how this man's shooting me around a wall. <laughs> we take those. Made it round the corner. Safe. Yep, the guy's disapparated. This guy doesn't sound like Indonesian militants. Talk, damn you. Where is it? And down you go. Well, apparently he wasn't even tied to the uh, chair. Yes. It's been a while. Fisher? My god, man, you're getting old. You still in one piece? Where are the rest of the seals? I'm working alone. Haven't been navy for a hey, decade. Adrian. Then who are you with? I'm here on damage control. Just came to smash your computer. Thank God. Oh, should I say the CIA? Keep guessing. I tried to destroy it, but who knows how much data they were able to pull down. The few recurring characters. Yeah, aren't they like mates the from who do you work for? Afghanistan or Delta? something? No. Staying anonymous. Uh huh. Maybe you've got a use for this storage device I pulled off the gorilla I killed. Thanks. How'd you hide it from your guard? Just wash your hands when you're done with it. Yeah. Oh boy, SD cards. Gramble nonsense. It was PGP encrypted. Easy stuff. For all the good it did us, the body text is gibberish. Brunton thinks it's a regional Indonesian dialect. We're looking for a translator. But we got the sender's alias, Mortified Penguin. And four words in the body text, Redbeard, Saulnier, and Springfield. My CIA people came through for us. The dialect is Timorese Mambe. There's an agency bureaucrat working in the embassy, an Indonesian linguist, a woman named Carlson. First name Ingrid. She's being held in a tower off the garden behind the embassy grounds. Good We're just working on a way to contact her without alerting her guard. Carlson's your next objective. Details on your upset. Compact flash. Now, mate, laser disc. I never got a chance to thank you for Baghdad. I just did what was necessary. Yeah, I remember this guy. Doesn't he show up again? Did that ever in... get to court? Yeah. He shows up in history stood by blacklist. Me. Washington settled my countersuit out of court. It means that now I can afford to choose my own battles. If whoever's hiring can afford you. Listen, if you're looking for a job when you get back to the states, look me up. Could set you up with some work stateside. You wouldn't have to spend so long away from your daughter. What's her name? Sarah? What were you doing here? Offering my services to the Timorese. This part of the world's about to get a lot less friendly. Who was it that knocked you unconscious? Mm -hmm. No idea. But he was good. They were shut us in Pandora. I don't think I'm doing chaos theory. They're hit right. that hard since basic training. I'll stay here and lie low until the Delta forces show up. All right. Oh, hi. Covering you. That open. In, in here, where I know nobody's going to come. There we go. Oh, wow. Okay, if you duck while uh, running, you'll drop into a roll. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. On. There we go. Oh, okay. Med kits now have charges. Okay. We're looking for the garden.
hearing someone walking around, but I don't see anybody. all them the two my friends Smith and Wesson can't solve unfortunately not even my friend Samuel Colt can get us out of this one bloody word corner here and you'll have a nice nap. Boobs bottle. These guys seem to be busy checking the map. Just quietly. No, they've padlocked that door. <laughs> Damn it. Right. So this game is a bit more there's a, there's a bit more like mid tones between light and darkness in this game. Actually, that's a point, Adrian. How I assume you're for, judging by your um by what you said, you have some familiarity with the Splinter Cell games. How attached are you to the first one? Like, are you particularly fond of the first game? Damn, why? was sloppy. I don't know if that this is exactly what happened, but um, I like how the guy, one of the guys that was checking the map over there, heard his mate go down, but couldn't see because it's dark, and just started like spraying wildly into the darkness where he heard the yell. This looks like some sort of safe. Nothing I can interact with, though. Oh, I see. This is the way that I'm meant to go. Is I'm meant to sort of go wide around that bit and then come out here. Right. My fault. I should probably be a bit more liberal about shooting out light sources when there's guys around. lacked critical information well to be like to be fair it wasn't the game's fault that time that was just me not paying attention i was looking looking at the guys not thinking about where i should be trying to go i need to very quickly use the gents so once we load in i'm gonna pause and use the laboratory Go. Okay, so it's left me on a save screen. We'll be right back. Okie dokie, and we're back. So I'm definitely going to say this much. Uh, Pandora Tomorrow is definitely feeling a lot better than, than uh, the first one. 
the the gameplay feels a lot smoother and more responsive. And generally it feels more like I'm sneaking, you sneaking, you know. Grim's daughter thinks she's gotten through to Ingrid. There's a guard near her. But she was able to snag a flashlight. She's in the right window on the second floor. You are. You're not gonna like this. Chances are. Security camera tap shows a lone guard overlooking the next courtyard wearing night vision goggles. Yeah, left window, I see him. There's an automated searchlight they haven't shut down. Should be blinding through night goggles. You're telling me to stay in the light? I said you wouldn't like it. Uh, okay. We're inverting things a bit here. This is clever. Right. The light to do another lap and then we'll make a go for it. So if I turn on my goggles... Okay. I was just curious to see if, like, in... Night Vision... Vision. Dang it. Stage one. Black jackets on. Alarm stage one. Sam, don't be detected. Fine. You need to be a ghost. You're putting the mission in danger. It's fine. It's just testing uh, with the goggles to see if I put the goggles on if the light would just appear to be, you know, a patch of, like, blinding white. Here we go. Through. Nice and slow. Clonk, clonk, clonk. What is going on? Why did I take damage there? That was really weird. Okay. Not quite sure what happened there, but Wait, is there like another sniper that I couldn't see? No, there's nobody else here, so what hit me? Because that other guy was... That sniper guy was facing the other way. Alright, whatever. Ingrid. You must be my blind date. I hope the bit with the flashlight helped. It did, thanks. I'm doing the best I can. This hasn't turned out to be the desk job I was hired for. I'm a word cruncher. Word crunching is what I need. Look. You're taking this very well, nice considering. PDA. Are you saving up for the color model? Can you read it? It's phonetical mambe. Not a native speaker, but fluent. Gives numbers for a meeting place. 4857 North. 0308 East. 18 hours. The only reference to the location is Solnier. That's not mambe. It says they're only a few weeks from securing the uh, ingredients for the Springfield demonstration. And that's it. It's signed, Mortified Penguin. Mortified Penguin? Your guess is as good as mine, but I wouldn't recommend guessing. And while you're at it, forget everything you've seen, heard, and said. Are you going to be all right if I leave here? Would you stay if I said no? No. Well done, Fisher. <laughs> There's a nice synchronicity between those coordinates and the name Sonier. Both match a cryogenics lab in Paris. 
And we just got word from Delta. They're sending their boys in. Which means you're off the leash. Merry Christmas, Fisher. Shoot all the gorillas you like. You have a quick Hooray. exit downstairs at the base of the tower. Cohen is waiting for you in the village. The Osprey can't land in the village. Cohen's afraid of being too good a target. Cut the power from all the spotlights in the village. They'll fly as low as possible to pick you up at the end of the pier. All right. You're right, mate. Oh wow, he kept firing as he went down. Oh, this looks like spot map station. Oh. That's as bad as but yeah, we've got that death grip. Okay, so it seems that it, that is actually a inbuilt system that enemies will fire wildly into the darkness if they think they see you. I'll have to keep that in mind. Uh, because I don't want to get my head blown off. Howdy. Mission complete. That's heroic music. All right. Oh, nice. No, so and we have uh, final stats. Neat. Not exactly useful information, but good. Could be useful if you were going for like an absolute ghost mode, I suppose. Into the tack dinghy. It's not even the tack dinghy, it's just someone else's dinghy that we pinched. Oh boy, it's the news. Rescued from the US Embassy to Dili by Delta Forces, stationed at the nearby training grounds of the Timorese Defense Force. All but one of the hostages have been accounted for, though. Continue to voice protest at Japan's formation of an information self-defense force, promising sanctions of both. What? We're, we're skipping through this Kellner's very quickly. Of increased U.S. military presence in East Timor with cautious support, justifiably wary of the response from neighboring. Who's sitting on the controller? You keep skipping through things. Honestly. Okay, so we're off to Paris. Enemy agent operating under the alias Mortified Penguin has broken into the Saunier Cryogenics Lab with a gang of French and Syrian mercenaries. Right. Ah, we finally get the... Uh, the famous really weird space gun that Sam Fisher always has. Welcome to Paris. You'll have time for sightseeing later. Thanks, Lambert. Grimm extracted enough from Saunier's security systems to trace Mortify Penguin's movements, but we don't know why, what he wants, or who he is. Is he still inside? Hard to say. The man's cover is rock solid. Are you saying he's CIA? If he is, he's on a deeper cover than I've ever seen. We've got intel that he went to at least a dozen French Syrian terrorists. As Mortified Penguin? The email alias is all we've got. It's ridiculous, but that's probably the point. Like the smiley face on a cobra's hood. Oh. Whoa! Okay. So, surface level the game very similar to SE1, but personally had a much smoother gameplay experience with Pandora. Yeah, definitely I'm having I'm having a much uh oh god, okay. I'm having a much uh, smoother experience with this game. And also in terms of just like 
level design. This game's a lot better. I haven't uh, gotten like here. I haven't gotten locked in a corner yet. Whereas that happened a number of times with uh, with the first game. didn't see it. Is he still coming to investigate though? Come here mate. Wow. Okay. Bright lights will blind the shit out of you if you've got your night vision on. Sorry, I didn't think he had a friend. Okay. So, this is one thing that I definitely remember from the first time I played this. Now, as you go up in uh, alert phases, uh, enemies will start to get armor. Your temperature monitors are getting close to critical. Springtime in Paris. Try shooting the pipes. With a little luck, you'll hit coolant or at least water. Yo. Flooded the building, but I'm sure it's fine. They won't know it was me. Okay, so we're now in Saulnier, I think. Oh yeah, Paris... Paris is basically on the verge of geological collapse. Why did it go up? Oh. Well, too bad I died anyway. Wait, why did I... Why did the alarm go up? Company! Stage two. Fisher, if you remain a ghost, the alarm stage will decrease. Fisher, the situation will soon be out of control. Hmm. That's huge. Yeah, apparently the. Ah! Wait, what? Oh, damn it. I was trying to Goomba stop that guy and it didn't work. Okay. Let's try and be a bit more fucking careful here. Right. Alarm stage two. Fisher, if you remain a ghost, the alarm stage will decrease. Turn the lights off. But yeah, apparently the uh, the Eiffel Tower is like the biggest thing that you can be reasonably constructed in Paris. Because if they build anything bigger, there is a very real chance that it will just collapse. 
That looks, looks better in darkness. Yeah, I know! Didn't occur to me to turn the lights off. Oh, that's why. It's because there's a fucking camera there. That's why my security alert went up before. I can. Oh, no, I can't because. First try. Right. Sam, as soon as you get back to the States, I'm buying you a proper gun. Your pistol sucks. This is supposed to be a 5.7. Why does it take six shots to take down a guy who's bare only wearing a, a vest? Who did that? There we go. Was a little worried that that was going to turn on more lights, but it's fine. Sneak attack bonus. No. That's what you get for neglecting your basic skills, Sam. If you rely on your stealth attack bonus all the time, you won't do damage when it matters. There we go. We are we're, we're beginning to believe. Just I need to play this slow. I have the ability to peek. Come on. Every time I adjust my weight, but. I need to peek through doors before... Sam's what happens when a Skyrim character only has stealth archery? Yeah, so that's the only way he can do damage. Good, you're so in. Patched. Grim's daughter suggests first accessing the security terminal on your floor, so she can investigate network activity oh. in the complex. She can't do it remotely. No, the important files are off the grid. His case file says the Founder was worried about the government stealing his client's files when the apocalypse rolls around. A perfectly rash- into the auditorium. We never know. Yep. A perfectly rational thing to be worried about. What the hell? Never here. He's gone. Okay, we we are beginning to believe here. Fisher, we need those access codes. Company! What happened? Did anybody see that? I don't know what happened. Confirmed. The basement is clear. I repeat, basement clear. Knock out. I think we managed to save that situation. 
light switch in here. That that bit probably would have been a bit less sketchy if uh, get you right out the back. But that would have probably been a bit less sketchy if uh, I hadn't already gotten to the point where these guys had helmets. So. I could have just burst I could have just bust in and shot them. I'm in. Great work, Fisher. What do we got, Grim? Let's see. Mortified Penguin cracked their system directories. Looks like all of his attention was focused on the client databases. Meaning, he was looking for specific frozen dead men. What do the client databases say? Nothing from here. It's a separate network. Oh my god. What? What? The mercenaries just remote triggered a bomb timer. Where is oh it? My God. The signal is coming from the boiler room, further down the corridor. Security stage back to normal. God damn it, I don't have time. Uh facing away. On. And there we go, just pull all of those cables out. Okay, done. Well done. Ooh. Now you can access the database. That's one floor up and your next objective. We're fine. Man, whoever these guys are, they are dedicated to the cause that they were ready to sit there and defend the bomb. up to the database client servers ocean detectors so motion detectors are the big red lights got it is there any way of telling... There does not appear to be a way of telling their range. I'll just have to keep an eye out. Security stage back to normal. As long as you go long enough without being seen, then the alarm's reset. We've already taken his money. I don't think we have a choice but to bear the job as well as we can. My introduction to Poindexter was through Bill Karim, who would tell me nothing about him save that we should that he should not be crossed. Our families will be fine. We simply need to do our jobs. I do not know how Poindexter lost his thumb or finger. Bill Karim suggested that he cut off his own earlobes. Please don't do anything unwise. Yikes, okay, whoever Abdul is, he is not to be fucked with. Shad's suggestions worried me. Again, nothing is as important as this Thursday's work as discretion. No evidence, no loose ends. You have been paid, you are professionals. Failure will be with punishment. Punishment will extend to family. Windexter. Okay, what the fuck?
just going to quickly grab you and pull you into that nice dark corner over there. I found the guard on the security cameras. I think you were right. Looks like he's behind that big bolt type door. The label on the monitor says body processing room. Wasn't detected. You're putting the mission in danger. What are you? Not entirely certain what, if anything, spotted me. Oh no! I have a bad feeling that I may end up. <laughs> That this uh, this game might end up getting skipped as well because by my count we have triggered three alerts without actually triggering any alerts. Oh no, that's why it's because there's there's like six cameras in the fucking server room. I even have that room. I'm not supposed to go anywhere near it. Right in there. To be any reason to go in there, though. Okay, security office has nothing in it. Security stage back to normal. Stage one, Sam, don't be detected. Fisher, I shot him in the neck. What do you want? What do you mean I'm paid? I bought this game. I'm paying you. Wait. So hang on. Where the hell am I going? My database on the first basement. going to remove these cameras. Last one is over there because I can hear it. The bullets on this pistol really just don't go where you point them. Here we go. I'm inside the client storage database. I'm tapped. Taking a look, see? I see at least eight clients mortified penguin pulled up in detail. Anything in common? All frozen in the last six months, and all cheapskates. They all booked economy tickets to the future, just their brains frozen. The low-end storage device is called an ND-133, vacuum-powered refrigeration. Where did Mortified Penguin hit next? Limited storage. Uh -huh. It's where Saulnier stows all the ND-133s. That sounds like your next objective, Fisher. Find us some French brains. I won't promise anything. Do your best. 
Details on your opset. <laughs> Do your best. Okay. Where am I going next? Two four five seven. I think I remember there was a keypad back in this kind of direction. E? There we go. Fuck. Oh. Two, four, five, seven. It's well, we got save. Oh. Ugh. Sometimes when you press the button, it doesn't respond. Very strange. Right, let's see if we can finish Paris before the end of the session. Leaning against the wall. Hey, why are you not moving away from the wall? Oh, you saw that, though. Keys. Data stick. Careful, he makes me nervous. I've got no idea how he lost the leg, but I have seen the scar when he rubs lotion on the stumps beneath the prosthetic. It's not pretty. Looks like a wound whose cheek purpose was pain. All of what's left looks like chewed gum. Remind me of that voice we knew out of Baghdad. Right. So whoever this... I'm guessing that's, uh, Abdul. This guy's been through some shit, apparently. Okay, so two guys go in here. Facing away, good. Here. Go. And the pistol is inaccurate. I assume nothing good. Let's avoid it. Wretch, use this opportunity to break my back out. Ouch. We've got ten more minutes. All right. Security stage back to normal. Spy two guys. Or 
I'm occupied with the computer. Let's put you to sleep. Oh. oh, you can just open the door now. Okay. Nice nap in the stairwell. Oh, okay, we've made it. This is ground level now. this is on the left stick rather than the d-pad is going to throw me a lot, I feel. I need to save. I've only just gotten here. Ooh! Oh, that's fucked I've got up. got your French brains, Lambert. So that's what happened to them. Mortified dumped the clients and took the ND-133. I guess we can assume he's not CIA. If he's willing to murder. Murder frozen organs. You can't murder the dead. Semantics. I think we've got a way to ID the penguin. The security guard everybody's so excited about? His name is Francois Coldebuff. Our intercepts suggest he got a lucky picture of mortified penguin with his cell phone, was wounded, and locked himself Ooh. inside body processing. Let's see. Processing? Where they pull the brains out of the skull. Introduce yourself to Mr. Coldebuff and get that phone. All right. This guy. Mm. Yep. Yeah. Right. So they don't want the brains. They just want the freezer. The security guard has locked himself in the. Locked himself in the uh, surgical theatre. Security stage increased. Stage one. Black jackets on. Alarm stage one. What? Sam, don't be detected. Fisher. Oh, oh pop. Ah. Okay, I think I need to take a break. We're gonna call it a night here because, oh boy. Guys, I think I have bad news. I think these games might be bad. <laughs> boy, oh boy. The end of year roundup is going to be an interesting one. Alright, let's uh, head on over to the booth and we'll see if anybody is. anybody's about. Oh boy, okay. Zoop. We have what do we have? Twitch following. Here we go. Okay, we have got some Halo 2. We've got League of Legends. Ugh, no, I'm not going back. Subnautica, Dice Folk, Undertale, Final Fantasy 14, or more Stardew Valley. Um Hmm. None of these seem particularly interesting, I'll be honest. So, another time, I think. But until that other time, we'll be back again on Thursday, and uh, we're going to try and grit our teeth through the rest of this, uh, through the rest of this, but I have a funny feeling it's going to be hard work. 
But uh, until then, thank you all for joining me. I'll uh, see you on Thursday. Good night and much love. Hello, everybody. And welcome back to Splinter Cell Pandora Tomorrow. Previously, we had given up on Splinter Cell 1. The game was not very good. So we're playing the second game, which is feeling a bit better, but we still have had a couple of moments of... Uh, guards seeing me around corners and guards calling in an alert while I'm in the middle of shooting them to death. So we'll see. We may not make it all the way through this one either. Uh, we can but hope. Anyway, hi there, Colonel. Congratulations on getting here uh, before I'd even, like, fired the alert. Push yourself up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, when last we left off, we had arrived here in Paris. We are tracking down someone by the name of Mortified Penguin, who is some sort of hacker in relation to a attempted coup in a completely different country and apparently he we're now following him to a cryogenics lab in Paris where he's uh, just stolen a freezer for some reason hey there father demon hope you don't have any particular attachments to this game because I'm about to potentially drag it through the muck. So these guys just straight up have radio packs so they can they can call in alerts while you're in the middle middle of beating them into unconsciousness. Let's heal myself. Yep, Splinter Cell uh, specifically this is Pandora tomorrow. Because we didn't make it all the way through the first one. Right now we are looking for one Francois Coldebeuf, who has uh, got a picture of our man. The bo box? Can I drop down and just... I get past him, he's just... I'm at the body processing room, and it looks like you were right. Norman said he uh, wounded the guard, Here we go. blood on the door handle. Don't stop searching the rest of this dungeon, but I'm gonna need some help to get past this door. It's built like a vault. Yeah, the security guard... Security guard we're looking for has locked himself in the surgical theater. Playing favorite game. Oh boy. Okay. I have bad news for you because I'm kind of not enjoying this game so far. I don't know what you're talking about. What what box are you referring to? Pandora's box. Oh! Lights. Pandora tomorrow in the box yesterday. Ah! And then the world. Turn those back on! Please don't. Aim at the handle. Not working. What would you suggest? 
I'm sure there's some kind of fuel in this place we could use. Take a look. We'll keep trying here. Maybe if we can't reach the guard, you can cook them. Oh, lovely. All right, well, let's get in, see if we can get in through the vents. Hey, you for... Francois? Dang it. Hey, I'm trying to talk to this guy, but I keep picking I'm not up. here to add to your troubles. Are you badly hurt? No. I'm living, I think. You are? I'm from the phone company. There's been a recall. What? I'm gonna need to take your telephone. I... I'm very confused. Give me the phone, Francis. It's our boy. So that's Mortified Penguin. Compliment Mr. Kodabuff on his photography. We got a facial match off CIA databases. Norman Soth, U.S. citizen. What's that ID code? Does it mean he's an agency asset? No, it means they don't know. I'm running him through Echelon. We could have a location on him within the hour. Great work, everybody. Fast. Make yourself scarce, Fisher. Cohen's waiting outside for extraction. Right. Right what? Uh -oh. uh, sorry, mate. I am afraid I'm going to have to leave you. There's no way I can get him out of there. Lock jammed. Oh, piss. Oh, get out. I mean, I hope this is far enough away, but it's probably going to be a very loud bang. Two, one. That was a fine way to think, Kodaba. I get the feeling you're being sarcastic. He didn't need to die. Fine. I won't. Okay. Uh, can I? I load it back. Okay, I unfortunately cannot load it back a uh, checkpoint. Hmm. Hang on. Let's. I. I want to see if I can. Let's see if we can load it back and. Uh, actually save that guy. I was not really seeing a way I could have gotten him out of there, because there wasn't a pick him up option. Let's let's try this in a try this again. Let me pick up the guy so I can move him. Light levels in this game are very inconsistent. What the game considers darkness or not. Alright, 
I should do it. Through, shouldn't I? Tappity tappity tappity. Okay. Actually, save it this time. your French brains, Lambert. So that's what happened to them. Mortified dumped the clients and took the ND-133. I guess we can assume he's not CIA, if he's willing to murder. Murder frozen organs. You can't murder the dead. Semantics. I think we've got a way to ID the Penguin. The security guard everybody's so excited about? His name is Francois Coldebuff. Our intercepts suggest he got a lucky picture of Mortified Penguin with his cell phone. Was wounded yeah. and locked himself inside body processing. Processing? Where they pull the brains out of the skull. Introduce yourself to Mr. Codebuff and get that phone. I'm at the body processing room, and it looks like you were right. Norman said he wounded the guard, and there's blood on the door handle. Don't stop searching the rest of this dungeon. But I'm gonna need some help to get past this door. It's built like a vault. Yep, I saw the light jump there. Shame I can't grab this guy by his ankles and just dump him on the floor. Why did the alarm go up? You're taking unnecessary risks when you don't hide the bodies. I did hide the body. What do you mean? Turn those back on. I hid the body. Like, what? What do you want? I hid the body. What would you suggest? I'm sure there's some kind of fuel in this place we could use. Take a look. We'll keep trying here. Maybe if we can't reach the guard, you can cook him. Alright, how do I get the guy out of here? I'm not here to add to your troubles. Are you badly hurt? No. I'm living, I think. You are? I'm from the phone company. There's been a recall. What? I'm gonna to need to take your telephone. I... I'm very confused. Give me the phone, Francis. That's not how you pronounce his name, and you know it. So that's Mortified Penguin. Compliment Mr. Kodabuff on his photography. We got a facial match off CIA databases. Norman Soth, US citizen. What's that ID code? Does it mean he's an agency asset? No, it means they don't know. I'm running him through Echelon. We could have a location on him within the hour. Great work, everybody. Make yourself scarce, Fisher. Cohen's waiting outside for extraction. Right. Right what? Okay, th there's the... That's the way out, that's the vent. Is there any way out of here besides the door and the air vent? You are thinking I would still be here if there was? How did you end up in here? Who are you? You're- I'm a penguin hunter. I could tell the bald guy was the- I can't wait for Don. I am get- Now you're getting it. A pumpkin that kills penguins for the phone- Now you're being ridiculous. How do I move This him? is not funny! I don't want to- This is not funny! I don't want to die- How 
quite move him. You sure that's safe? Go away. You sure that's safe? Go away. Don't hurt me, please. I'm just doing my job. Okay, well, apparently there is no way to save him. That was a fine way to think, Kodobo. I get the feeling you're being sarcastic. He didn't need to die. Fine. Apparently he did, because the game wouldn't let me save him. I'm putting you up for psych evaluation. I don't know why the game's insulting me. I literally did not have an option to pick him up and move him. To be honest, this game is not making a very good impression. It's definitely doing a lot better than the first game did, but an additional eight thousand U.S. troops arrived in East Timor today in the biggest. Military intelligence released the information that Derrida Doa leader Suwadi Sadano was not only responsible but on site at the March 28th hostage crisis at the U.S. Embassy to East Timor. Headed by Abraham Zerkazi to reverse engineer the programs developed for the Georgian information crisis was declared a success by its UN. Okay, so that's the first game. Derrida Doa guerrillas along the East Timor border. No U.S. casualties were. supposed to know who that is. Oh, no, sorry, that's the mortified penguin guy. Yes, they said he had a prosthetic leg. I remember. What do you think? It's... The world is small, nasty, and complicated, and everybody dies alone. Hmm. What do you think about Norman Saab? He's small, nasty, and complicated. I guess how he'll die is up to him. <laughs> I don't think Saab even knows whether or not he's still working for the CIA. I'm a good judge of character. That must be why we get along so well. Alright, you're gonna pass right down to a train. Don't touch the uh, cables. CIA trained operative Norman Soth. Been located on a southbound Hesperia Railways train, accompanied by a squad of French Syrian mercenaries. Locate and question South in order to determine his status as an enemy or friendly operative. Or we could just ask the CIA, fucking hell. Things aren't mutually exclusive. Christ, that's loud. Does that include killing him? Yeah. Leave him alive, if you don't mind. Updates on your opset. Probably safe to assume I'm not going to be able to get that door open. Is there a 
Santa? No, that does not appear to be a means of getting him to the roof. Ah, but he's coming out to investigate the bullets. You go. Doubt anyone's going to find him out here. Data, what do we have? Yeah, so that's our man. Some Leon, pick up some butter from the mill. Level is M. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's fine. And cap him so he's he's fine to go and see the missus. Oh, hello. Easier to get around. Very glad that Fisher doesn't have a stamina bar or anything. Poindexter, a.k.a. Soth, used to buy the train tickets. What's the complication? Two seats in coach. Looks like you have at least two terrorists mixed in with the civvies in the cheap seats. But you're dealing with tight quarters. I wouldn't risk anything lethal. You don't have the room to maneuver if there are complications. Okay. Hey, are you taking anything? Anything for what? You know, an account of the cargo. Shut up! What? Nobody here can... I'm not worried about these people. But if the boss hears us talking, neither of us is walking off this train. Go turn the lights back on. We've got visitors. Our cover's been blown. We're getting off the train now. Oh, okay. Thoth knew. Yeah, he absolutely knew I was there. Because I'd socked that dude in the head and he didn't even. Right. I wonder if any. Father Demon, if you're still here, you said this was your favorite game. For you Found yeah, credit played it recently. Dexter, AKA Soth, used to buy the train tickets. What's the complication? Two seats in coach. Looks like you have at least two terrorists mixed in with the civvies in the cheap seats. But you're dealing with tight quarters. Let's see if I can... Oh, okay. God, I hope you've got good grip strength, Sam. Them to get distracted by anything. Fine. <laughs> okay, this is pretty cool, but mechanically, this game is not doing well.
open. Up. Heave. There we go. Whistling is too loud. Yeah, that is quite astoundingly loud. But thankfully we're up in... Body of Alice is found. Oh, okay, good. For us. The sauce's right leg is more prosthetics in it than Lee Majors. Apparently, he had a disagreement with the landmine. Might register different on thermal. Perfect. We've got visitors. Our cover's been blown. We're getting off the train now. Damn. They know you're there. Mission's over. Get out of there. Okay, that one I will accept because I hung around, like, staring while the uh, security guard was going back and forth. Brunton's chums and the CIA came through for us. Sauce's right leg is more prosthetics in it than Lee Majors. Apparently, he had a disagreement with the landmine. Might register different on thermal. Perfect. Let's wait for you to Monsieur, turn up. You requested earplugs? Ah, yes. I'm very sorry, but I couldn't find any. If your neighbors start shouting again, please feel free to call me and I'll ask them to be quiet. Thank you. I'm very sorry. I don't understand how Stoth knew I was here. The fuck. We've got visitors. Our cover's been blown. Okay. Off the train now. I think there needs to be there needs to be a different way that I need to approach this. Like, how does Soth know we're here just from some random dude seeing me? Pretty sure Soth doesn't run this train. Is there like... Through for us. Soth's right leg is more prosthetics in it than Lee Majors. Don't get that open. Apparently, he had a disagreement with a landmine. Might register different on thermal. Perfect. Monsieur, you requested earplugs? Ah, yes. I'm very sorry, Oop. but I couldn't find any. If your neighbors start shouting again, please feel free to call me and I'll ask them to be quiet. Thank you. I'm very sorry. Okay. Remember how this works? He's reading his book. Yeah, you need to would you use that move that hardly ever comes up. Hold your breath, Sam. Yeah, we're looking for a guy whose leg doesn't show up on thermal. Go piss off, please. Dude! He won't move. I'm trapped here, this guy won't move. Who's there? Alright. I got away with that somehow. Who are you supposed to be? Nobody of consequence. We've got well. Our cover's been blown. We're getting off the train now. Damn. They know you're there. Mission's over. Get out of there. 
That's how I meant to get past there. The security guard just stopped. Monsieur, you requested earplugs? Ah, yes. I'm very sorry, but I couldn't find any. If your neighbors start shouting again, please feel free to call me and I'll ask them to be quiet. Thank you. I'm very sorry. Granton's chums and the CIA came through for us. Sauce's right leg is more prosthetics in it than Lee Majors. Apparently, he had a disagreement with a landmine. Might register different on thermal. Perfect. We're supposed to go in there. He didn't do that before. Oh no, now he's coming back. What the fuck? It's done it again. Okay, well I got it that time without alerting the guy in the room, so... Dexter. There we go. First, you tell me, who are you? I'm your Uncle Sam. Come to make sure you're still one of the good guys. How do I trust you? Your name's Norman Soth. Ask me about the chestnut tree. Okay, fine. What are you doing here? If the men I'm with catch us talking, they'll kill us both. To that was weird. The uh, counterphrase was in the subtitles, but he didn't it's say an agency it. Job. The Joint Chiefs want a military presence in Indonesia, and I was part of the plan. That's all I can say. Who's your runner? Clifton Finch. The voices are different the to the subtitles. Sir? What is it now? You have a phone call. Stay hidden and don't make a noise. What happened to the guy that I knocked Sorry out? Sorry if I woke you. It's him. Is this a fresh phone? We put the chip in just an hour ago. Good, let's go to the bar car. I don't want to talk here. He was lying about his handler, wasn't he? Yeah. Finch has been on sick leave for 16 months. Hack the laptop now. And trail Soth. Laser mic that call. We still can't risk blowing Soth's cover. Fisher, we need that phone call. Dime to a dollar, he's talking to Sedono. Hang on. Use it first. Mike. Okay, he's gone to the, the dining car. It's being very sus. Good work. Grim? Give me a sec. Focusing on the Timorese Mombe for expediency's sake. The new translator will take a few seconds to catch up. Take your time. There. Yes. Springfield demonstration. 80% plus fatalities. Custer would be proud. What the hell does that mean? 
Nothing good. What about that? Might be daily phone calls to delay release. Translator's still a little hinky. Right. Hinky. We've got enough to work with. Get topside, Fisher. We're pulling you out of there. Alright. So I guess now I just want to head towards the back of the train. Oh! <laughs> Maybe I need to Custer leave through the proud. other way? What the hell does that mean? Nothing good. What about that? Might be daily phone calls to delay release. Translator's still a little hinky. Right. We've got enough to work with. Get topside, Fisher. We're pulling you out of there. Right, so he's now facing the window. Leave out the front rather than out the back. We've got visitors. Our cover's been blown. We're getting off the train now. Talk to me about level of force. It's them Move. or you. We're out. Oh, that's a helicopter. Leg it. Just leg it. Made it away. Alright, zero alarms triggered. We take those. I'm gonna be honest, the fact that there's like zero freedom to how you approach these is kind of bothering me a bit. It's just like you go slightly off the beaten track and it's just like, nope, you lose. Of Indonesia has submitted formal protests against supposed US sorties across the Timorese border. Oh God, stop and with these if junk Indonesia's cuts. government continues to hamper our efforts to combat terror, we will make our displeasure known. Has effectively driven the Deridandoa out of East Timor, crushing individual cells of guerrilla fighters. The situation in Indonesia should be resolved within... Have given U.S. troops for limited sorties onto Indonesian land, but only under supervision by... These cuts just mean that I have no idea what's going on. Lambert, do you really think I need these two nannies? I'm a big boy, you know. Sam, on this mission we have to work closely with the local authorities. It's related to the bank account we found on Salk's laptop. A large payment was made to a charity cover-up for a Syrian terrorist cell operating in Jerusalem. I knew the Penguin was a benefactor, and... You'll have more details once you get on site, big boy. Oh boy. Okay, so this is where I remember getting to in the game the first time I played it. For some reason... I don't think I got past this mission, but...
Third echelon has links to Stadono's Springfield demonstration to the black market purchase of an unknown biological agent. Okay, so she's going to show us where the, the purchase is taking place. a cultural opportunity for you. The birthplace of Judaism, Christianity, and Islam. So this is where all that peace and love came from. Exactly. Yeah. Recent attacks have led authorities to put a curfew in place, which is what accounts for tonight's peace. In other words, you should have basically empty streets. Great. The fewer civilians, the easier my job gets. I couldn't tell from the flash notes whether we're dealing with Shinbet or Mossad here. Let's hope for your sake it's Mossad. Between the lines back at Fort Meade, reads like our side's having trouble getting straight answers from Israeli intelligence. <laughs> Sounds about right. This looks like a touchy mission. Grunton is coordinating with local intelligence. Mossad? Even better. Shinbet. Spooky. Who are we torturing? Just you. First thing you're going to need is to retrieve your SC-20K. Wouldn't it make more sense just to give it to me? We have the barrel altered to reduce sonic placement. Only one man with those skills in the area. An old arms dealer slash CIA plant working out of the back of a small shop. He'll be waiting for you. Details on your opsat. Okay. I mean, I've scarcely fired a single shot out of that thing all game, so... Who's there? Nobody. Somebody having an argument in there. Oh my god. Digging this music though. Unfortunately, I do not speak a word of Hebrew. What's projecting that line? Oh, okay, they're leaving. Dismount, Sam. Okay. You cannot stay here. You have to go home. Let me just finish my orange juice. You can finish it in prison if you want. Okay, I'm going. Fine. He definitely I sounds Israeli. Now. camera all the way around. Is he humming green sleeves? Hope this is the right shot because it's the only one whose roller shutters are up. We have no choice. We need to have them dead. We just want the guns and the money, Saul. We'll take your life too if we have to. But we don't want it. Mr. Brunton's man, no? Who were they? 
thieves. They shouldn't have been able to get this close to me. There must be something wrong with my security arrangements. I mean, the door was open, so... Yes. Only a small thanks compared to what I owe you. It's just... I don't quite trust this game. I have a bad. I have a. There's something in the back of my brain is telling me that they need to be hidden in the dark. Good. Feeling better with a warm gun in your hand? Much thanks. Your next objective is named Dahlia Tal. Brunton. Ms. Dalyatal. She's a Shinbet agent in deep cover with local terrorist cells. She's our link to Norman Soft's terrorist connections. We're hoping she'll be able to tell you about a large bank account transfer from one of Sedano's heroin money laundromats. Well, the choice of the intel we pulled off Soft's laptop. Find Dahlia. She'll lead you to the mercenaries. Don't pick up the guy. I wanted to talk to... Talk to this dude. Made some modifications. Small ones, but yes. Mostly work on acoustics in the barrel. And I finessed the trigger a bit, improved the firing action. Nice. If you like to give it a try, I know a discreet place nearby. I've scarcely used the rifle all game. I think I can get away with continuing to not use it. Moving on. Save since I've got the option. Hey, please. Can you tell me when the curfew ends? No idea. We had an incident in the Christian area this morning. Was it serious? Pretty serious, but less than the one last week. Now be quiet. God, this city is becoming more and more dangerous. Way forward, I can't tell. Looks like it needs somewhere. their life. This will never change. I don't like what happened in the grocery store. This is almost total anarchy now. They will never respect any of the peace road map anyway. Yes, I will keep on being busy. Speak for yourself. Who did it? Nobody claimed it. But you don't have to think twice to know. Will there be any reaction? I guess so. As usual. Dialogue. Another terrorist attack so in the city stiff. Will blow up. You know, we've been saying that for so long. Nothing changes. Only the number of dead in the list changes. It keeps growing. Wait, why the hell can I come in here if there's a guy in the way?
Now I'm stuck. Possible terror situation. Hmm. Hey, please. Can you tell me when the curfew ends? No idea. We had an incident in the Christian area this morning. It was it serious? That way, that's... Pretty serious, but less than the one last week. Now be quiet. God, this city is becoming more and more dangerous. Okay. Soup. Uh, go past. Keep going. Who are you supposed to be? Nobody you need to concern yourself with. Okay, looks like I got away with that one. People are tired and bored to stay home. If they prefer to risk their life. What happened in the grocery store? This is almost total anarchy now. They will never respect any of the peace roadmap anyway. Yes, I will keep on being busy. Speak for yourself. Who did it? Nobody claimed it. But you don't have to think twice to know. Will there be any reaction? I guess so. I shoot. Sure. Another terrorist attack okay. and the city will blow up. Doesn't you know, look like I can shoot that, that guy's so long? light out. Nothing changes. I There we go, just to wait for him to finish his friggin' cigarette. Back full leg! Why does the music keep hitching? Everything about this game confuses me. Stuff keeps happening and I'm just like, okay, but why? It's never explained. Running out of second chances here, game. Hey, please. Can you tell me when the curfew ends? No idea. We had an incident in the Christian area this morning. It was pretty serious. Like. I'm. I'm trying desperately to articulate what's going on in my brain, but every decision that this game makes, I'm just like, why? Why why do it this way? And there never seems to be an answer. People are tired and bored to stay home. If they prefer to risk their life, this will never change. I don't like what happened in the grocery store. This is almost total anarchy now. They will never respect any of the peace roadmap anyway. Yes, uh. we'll keep on being busy. Speak for yourself. Who did it? Nobody claimed it. Okay, but so that guy in the window isn't going to finish his cigar until these dudes finished. <laughs> until I these dudes so. finish talking. As usual. Uh, take up, excuse me. Another terrorist attack and the city will blow up. You know, we've been saying that for so long. Nothing changes. Only the number of dead in the list changes. It keeps growing. If you could have hired a extra translator for that bit, Jesus. Wait for. 
Let's go ahead and finish his cigarette. See, this is pretty cool. I like this bit of, you know, using platforming and ninja skills to get around stuff to, to like sneak by people. But the fact that this is the only way forward because this street is just full of cops who have, you know, fucking chameleon eyes. pretty cool but just the whole thing of why it took me three attempts to get off the train oh. yeah we got there but I have a clear identification of Dahlia she's waiting for you near the church she's wearing a traditional white outfit the code is is there a special hour for the mass Answer only in the morning. Oh boy, good old spy code phrases. So can I like climb through there? There we go. See, this is pretty cool. Using fucking parkour to get past the cops. This dude. Scum. I mean, judgment cut might help. There's nothing here. He doesn't see that. single pipe. There we go. It is known that video game guards Scum. cannot look up. Church. Let's wait for this guy to walk past so I don't get my self lit up. Very bright. Possible terror situation. Hang it. Oh, idiot. Got to remember the tools in the toolkit. identification of Dahlia. She's waiting for you near the church. 
She's wearing a traditional white outfit. The code is, is there a special hour for the mass? Why can I not? Answer, only in the morning. All right, platforming failed. Punch him in the mouth. Let's go back in the alley. Now I can climb. No, no, I can't. But the camera just like clipped into Sam's eyeball for a minute there. Shush. Didn't see nothing. Now he's leaving. There's nothing here. They don't know I'm there. They did the whole firing wildly into the darkness bit. But he still calls it in on the radio and I still get a game over. I have a clear identification of Dahlia. You're running out She's of second chances, game. She's wearing a traditional white outfit. The code is, is there a special hour for the mass? Answer, only in the morning. Okay. Looks like I don't need to parkour to get past. How did I get past that before? Because that's the exact same path between the two light sources that I took the first time. I have a clear identification of Dahlia. She's waiting for you near the church. She's wearing a traditional white outfit. The code is, is there a special hour for the mass? Answer, only in the morning. Who's there? You mean, well, he can look directly at me during that part and it still doesn't count. Keep using the platforming to get around. You see me up here? I'm kind of stuck. Yep. What are you doing? I don't know what I'm doing. The platforming guided me up here. clear identification of Dahlia. She's waiting for you near the church. She's wearing a traditional white outfit. What the hell? The code is, is there a special hour for the mass? Answer, only in the morning. It was so nerd. Okay. Yeah, the little thing takes you to there, but then there's nothing... Nothing for you to jump onto from that side. Do I have, like, a... Uh, 
And I've got like some weird special bullets, but. I'm going to stick around and see if this guy moves now he's finished his cigarette. I don't have like a bottle or anything I can throw. got past this a minute ago. How the hell did I do it? Because I can't just shoot him. Because it says lethal attacks will be mission fail. I have a clear identification of Dahlia. She's waiting for you near the church. She's wearing a traditional white outfit. The code is, is there a special hour for the mass? Answer, only in the morning. <sighs> Put this guy here, nice and out of the way. So where the hell does the game want me to go? Because there's nothing to climb on. Actually, I might have an idea. Okay. If you shoot the light out, he'll just go into alert anyway, so what's the fucking point? I have a clear identification of Dahlia. She's waiting right. for you near the church. She's wearing a traditional white outfit. The code is, is there a special hour for the mass? Answer, Last only in the Last chance morning. game. I am giving the game one more chance. Okay, so let's try and blast it from here. I wonder if I was just too close that you heard the gunshot. Okay, I think that was the problem. Same again there. And here, just for safety's sake. Who did that? Okay, so when it when it works, it works. Like shooting out the light there did let me get past. It's just, it was not clear why shooting the light previously worked, uh, didn't work, or why just sneaking past worked the first time. That's a shielded light source. Just have to make sure no one's facing my way. You're the only one that patrols the church ground, so as soon as you turn around, I should just be able to slip by. Uh, 
Took way too fucking long. Straight, straighten the old neck out, develop a frigging hunch. Fisher will really do anything to avoid doing a pull up. That's my contact, one assumes. Hey. Is there a special hour for the mass? Only in the morning. You took a long time. You You're have American. been long. Who are you? I'm friendly and looking for a friend of mine. You've seen this man. I feel you wouldn't be asking unless I had. What was he doing in Jerusalem? <laughs> it was like he just slapped her on the side of the head there. Details, details. I don't know any. Something biological. The Syrians have supposedly had it for over a decade, but it was too dangerous to move until your friend came along with some kind of storage devices. What was the deal? Your friend got the biological agent. He gave the Syrians a small mountain of US currency and one of the storage devices. Ah, the, the freezer, he Where's pinched. the device? I'll take you to the device, but stay out of sight. Anybody sees us together, and we'll be far from the only people killed. Good, because if you don't behave, I'll shoot you myself. Quite enough of this game fucking me about. Good thing that the streets out here are actually pitch black. Who are you supposed to be? Dang it. I wasted too much time. Move. Take three bullets. Wait, and soup. What are you doing on the street? I'm sorry, officer. I'm heading home now. The curfew is very clear. You're endangering yourself and others. Of course. But my father, I have to take care of him since he was wounded in one of the attacks. I was changing his bandages and must have lost track of time. I didn't intend. Ah, I see. Well, hurry home and be careful. This Thank you, officer. I will. Yes, one tier voice acting. Absolutely lawless deception there, lady.
Okay, we, we're making progress. We just need to keep going. Glad to see that the cops will harass some random lady, but not those two people praying in the middle of the night. It's half past one in the morning, why is there anybody out and about? <laughs> like, even if there wasn't curfew, I'd be suspicious. empty eyes. Don't move. What are you doing? The mission is nope. over. Nope. Yep, mission is over. I'm done. Fuck this game. Mm. Alright. I think we are gonna call it. That is enough. Oh my god. I I open this question to anyone who thinks they like this game. Have you played it recently? Good God. That is shameful. This whole affair is just misery. Okay. Mm. All right, let's head on over and see if anybody's about that we can go and say hey to and hopefully have a nicer time. What have we got? What have we got? Uh, we have got some Balatro. Uh, Hunt Showdown, Kingdom Come Delivereth, Civ 6, Master Duel, Undertale, Alan Wake, Raft, Helldivers, some art, Old School RuneScape, Trackmania, Dungeons and Dragons. Um, let's head on over to Matto. He's not someone like it. I, uh, get to raid very often. There we go, they are playing some raft on the high seas. Alright, so, uh, just so you know, a couple of differences in the coming days. Um, we will not be having a stream on Friday because I will be having visitors. And there will not be a stream on Monday because I am going to be out of town all afternoon. So we will be back again on Tuesday where we will try, by God, we will try to play Splinter Cell Chaos Theory. But until then, thank you all for joining me. What a hellscape. Good night. <laughs>